and we can't go close this inner cylinder and we do that by selecting this surface put the pull tool in it and drag it up and we drag it up for 20 to 0 just type it in on your keyboard and enter and you see here you select everything you know the distance between uh, this face and this face you easily measure with selecting this line press the control key and selecting the other line so and then click this measure tool and then it says the minimum distance between objects is two millimeters we gonna glue the photo in here and if we open and close the the heart shape then because it's at two millimeters below this face it wouldn't damage the picture that's the idea the next thing we do is we go to pull mode you see in, inside the pull mode we have the selection key and we select this edge we press control hold control and select the other edges as well so we have selected three edges and now we go to the let's do it different select uh, nothing so nothing is selected select this edge here and select the other ones so three are selected but now the arrow is here not that go to the option pool and we select this one it says copy edge click on it and you see it when we clicked on it it turns inside another kind of error and because three of them are selected we click on the one below and we drag the copied edge down for 16 so we drag, we drag it down for 16 and you see it's still selected zoom out to see it better we're walking on the on the left we if you click here the right one is invisible so it's easier to uh, to see what we're doing so you know with by zooming out and clicking on the, the scroll wheel we can see the line is perfectly copied and it's still selected so what we do next is we click on this thing and it's called a plane and because it's selected it it's it's, it's it plays the plane exactly on the new edge and you see a plane is you can see it as a construction line but then for a, a, a three dimensional object so a construction line is a one dimensional a plane is a two dimensional and it's, it's just a reference tool it's a helping tool it's not a real thing it's not if, if i try to print it it, it wouldn't be converted to the to the printer what we do now is uh, we're gonna split the, the bodies and we click on split body and now it gives you a selection tool select the body you want to split click on it and it gives you automatically a saw you know to split to saw the object in two parts and we want to saw it on the plane so we click on the plane 
it, you see the it, it splits the body so we have now two objects after we did the saw action it gives us automatically an eraser but we don't want to erase something because uh, if I click now over here then it will erase this object but we gonna use both of them so but watch out with the eraser and if you erase something just click on the undo and do your action again but now nothing is selected go to split body split this one uh, select this one it gives you automatically the saw go to the plane click on the plane it cuts around the, the plane in another object and then it gives you the eraser but we not using the eraser go to select and we we click on this one and we call this one the bottom left bottom rename call it left left underscore bottom and this one is going to be the right bottom underscore what them uh, we call this one left underscore top and we call this one right underscore top 